So here's my heater that I've been playing with. See the flame inside there? I took an old wet cell that I had the guts for, and basically I just uh, bent up a bracket and kind of put a little shield against the fan that's coming through there. You can see it's coming through. Let me see if I can zoom in. And I just took a duct, a floor duct for HVAC system, a heat pump that comes out of the floor. And I just mounted a little 12 volt fan on the top. Got my cell. And I've got my bubbler reservoir tank. 12 volt power source, a 40 amp uh, power inverter by Trip Light. And uh, right now I'm pulling 7.46 amps, 6.98 watts, 114.8 volts. Pretty good production. So you can see get the temperature reading. A little laser here. I'm getting two down there. Of course, that's going to read 600 degrees, basically. Heat should dissipate through that pretty good. So now I'm going to turn on the fan. Oh, that's warm. It's definitely warm air coming out. My little trusty assistant. Yeah. Now I got the grade on it. Some pretty warm air coming off there. Whoa. Is this the Six watts. Still pulling about eight amps. Tried hooking a SureFlow pump up to the cell. And I ended up with some leaks. It's just too much pressure. I even turned it on, hooked it up in line with a pot switch, a little potentiometer I had laying around, but it was just a little too much for it. It ate that up in about three minutes, so. And full speed with the pump was just too much. It was foaming pretty good, and I just decided to abort that whole idea. I know that this cell is not going to get too hot, but you can see that flame is going pretty good. all stainless steel. I think it'll be a lot more effective if I can narrow down about half the size that I'm using now with even a smaller, that's a pretty good fan. That's more, way more air that's coming out of my floor. And uh, I'm going to find the heat gun again. getting a reading of 92 degrees. It cools off when you go away from the, the, where the heating element's at. So that tells me that I want to probably just have half of this 
filled with that little cell in there, and that whole thing's hot. It's radiating real good heat off the right side. And I'm running a... It's, a, it's an old sit cell. I still have all these plates and stuff. And I've got a, an idea for a design. My partner Gary and I have talked about a different design. Basically, a lot of other people have already gone to it, excluding bolts going through the center. You just have nothing but problems with leaks and, and uh, stuff like that. So, Anyways, Gary, when you see this, this is what I've been playing with. And I can't wait to see your design up there. Hydro Gas Technologies, we're signing out.